everybody, this is Steve from Engadget. I'm here with Valentin from the MIT Media Lab. And they've been working on an impressive uh, interface technology that lets you map uh, controls onto everyday household objects. So Valentin, could you explain to us exactly uh, how this technology works? Yeah. So what you see here is a normal radio. It has a, it has a volume knob and a tuning knob. So you can tune through different songs. And it's, it's tangible, so it's very simple to operate. I don't have to concentrate on a touchscreen or something. But today, you expect a little bit more from something like that. You want something like iTunes. So this radio has a second layer on top of it. Uh, it basically um, has a graphical interface that is mapped on top of the physical object. So whenever um, I, can, I can just move that around, or whatever I do to the, to the physical thing, it gets represented into the graphical user interface as well. So here you have the radio with all of its, its mapping. So, but if you want to connect it to another speaker because you want to listen to a song a little bit louder, all you have to do is to throw a line to the speaker so the things get connected. And if you want to disconnect it, just swipe through it and it disconnects. So and then once you have programmed the things to your desire, you have chosen all your songs you want to listen to, the volume, you have connected it to your speakers. You don't need the, the touchscreen anymore to operate it. You can do that through the physical real things. All right, so this has been Valentin from the MIT Labs, and he's been showing off the, what's the name of this pro, uh, project? Smarter Objects. Smarter Objects. Mm -hmm. And that allows you to basically map a, uh, an interface from a, a tablet directly onto virtually any object. This is Steve from Engadget at CHI in Paris.